even shift, bro? I'm like, yes. Yes, I do. The Chad memes are true. Give up on your shit boxes and buy a truck. Women say they're most attracted to guys driving pickups. It's because they know these men have small penises and will lavish and worship any woman that stays with him. I drive a wagon, and my girl likes me and it enough to have wanted one exactly like mine, even in manual. I didn't know lesbians were on Slash O. Women like Hondas. They start up and get going every single time, unlike Machad, Ferd, or General Motors. Can't even tell you country based boys how many times I've picked up a cutie off the side of the road while her man worked his broken truck. They always ended up at my place instead of their house, lol. I drove a stupid big truck for work related things. Never had a single girl even look at me. And people seemed pissed at me even though I kept my distance when behind, never rolling up like tiny dick fags do when driving similar trucks. Got a 2016 RAV4 of all things. Didn't care to buy anything else, had a good deal on it, so got it. First week on the road, had several girls come up and say, Nice ride. Bright orange. Never seen a tall dude like you driving a small SUV before. I was expecting a 5'5 guy. She laughs. I'm 6'1 built. Get several numbers in less than a month of owning it. 2019, had around 100 or so numbers. Got with about 15 of them. Banged a few, as I am picky. Currently dating another nice ride pick from a few months back. She's the hottest girl I've had yet. Meanwhile, all these tiny dick faggot chads are driving noisy, overly tall nigger music blasting trash trucks. And not one I've seen with a girl. Not one. They all group together with similarly tiny dick wannabe I'm tough and manly. All man is the one not driving a raised tiny dick signal truck. Too long, didn't read. This is why you fail. My dad had a 1996 Ford Taurus. He didn't give a shit about it and let me piss my pants in the back seat. He didn't even care that the whole car smelled like old piss. We used it as a bathroom on road trips and never had to stop anywhere. It was awesome.